and welcome to the Oddity Archive, the show that is trying desperately to understand web video these days. So uh, the latest numbers recently came out for the last year, and uh, as I feared, five out of the top ten videos to come out in the last year were aimed at preschoolers. And just below the top ten, a whole ton of content of an uh, adolescent variety, as in the kind of stuff that mostly appeals to adolescent boys. So, I think I've got something here that will act as a silver bullet to both of these demographics. It's just a shame I can't work a makeup tutorial into this somehow. But anyway, today, let's tackle a pair of potty training videos, complete with my added toilet humor. You know, something for the little ones and something for the slightly less little ones. Sometimes I have to wonder where it all went wrong. But anyway, let's kick things off with, uh, I guess we'll start with what's on the box today. So, from 1994, it's Now I Can Potty. And uh, something tells me that kid doesn't quite grasp the notion of toilet paper yet. But uh, I guess I ought to explain all this for the benefit of our newfound younger viewership. So this, dear children, is a VHS video cassette. This was a consumer grade video format from the 1970s to 2000s. In other words, it's prehistoric. In other words, you, dear children, will most likely never have to deal with these things, because everything you want to see is up in some mythical server somewhere, and God forbid if that server ever crashes, because you might not be able to, you know, recover your video? <laughs> that might be important. But I digress. Let's run the tape. So what are you in for? Bootlegging potty training videos. Get away from me, man. This is, uh, you say, a very abstract piece, which is growing antenna. Uh, forget it. Okay, new rule. You can't use the word your acronym is spelling out in your acronym. <laughs> Title obviously written by an adult who was probably not an English major. One day, my mom, my dad, my brother Max and I went to the store to buy a potty for Max to sit on. Max started using the potty every day, but one day Max couldn't make it to the bathroom. Well, it's not easy when you're a satyr. Max started to cry and got upset, but my dad said everyone makes mistakes when they're learning to do new things. Hell, how do you think you were born? Best dad in the whole world. Dad, is it true what they say about big feet? Take it for granted, kid, because there's going to be a couple of years when you're in your 20s when you won't have a potty to piss in. I felt just like a grown-up when I sat there that first time. And the tape starts trying to self-destruct already. I have my Why do I feel like I'm being watched? I used to wear a diaper, but now you see I'm grown. My potty. Ah, yes, generic potty brand. That's what I had. I used to wear a diaper, but now you see I'm grown. Mom, why doesn't this toilet have a tank? Diapers on, then I took them off to see. It felt so cold and hard at first, but then it felt fine to me. Um, we're 
we're still singing from the two-year-old's perspective, right? But sometimes I just forget. My mommy says that's how it goes. I'm sorry, your roof is leaking, Mom. My potty, my potty. I have my berry. And the kid's gonna be pee shy for the rest of her life. Congratulations, video. But now you see I'm grown. She does it. She does it. And there's the requisite SCTV reference for the day. Diaper. And if you stick your head in, I'll show you what we call a swirly whirly. Oh good, I'm starting to forget there was life outside of the bathroom. Man, you could bounce a basketball off that perm. Now I feel so good and proud. A potty is my best gift. Let's hope she doesn't find out mom body used one. Out. Baby Budnick. My potty, my potty, I have my berry on. I used to wear a diaper. The mid-90s were not a good time for Melissa Manchester, were they? One day, my mom took me to work with her. My mom is a nurse and works in a nursing home where grandmas and grandpas live. In cages, apparently. My mom's job gave me a glass of milk and a muffin for a snack. After I ate that food, I had that feeling inside. I feel like I had to go to the bathroom. I didn't even know if they had a bathroom. Nah, the elderly all have to go outside and find a bush. To the bathroom. And it was just like ours at home. When I grow up, I'm going to be a nurse just like my mom. I hope you're better at basic human biology by then. The party every day, but I've been thinking about one thing when I go out with mom and dad. Is my party the thing to bring? Wait, that's brilliant! I mean, you can hardly find a damn public toilet anywhere anymore, and when you can, they're always nasty. I'll bring my own! When I'm My favorite Leonard Cohen lyric. Daddy say, there are parties all around. Whenever the feeling starts inside, a party. Yeah, yeah, apparently this is it with the hand drawn Sharpie sign. I, I really miss those potty training days. Good times. Damn budget cuts. Duran ice cream man, waitresses, farmers, and astronauts. And the firefighter has to moonlight as an astronaut. Tough times. Use the party for their pee pee and poo. All of these people and still many more use the party while they're away from home. Did this really need to be a slow jam? To poop and wee and your party. Really depressing, mommy. Oh, it's young Patsy before he joined up with King Arthur. I have a little sister, Jamie. I love her a lot. Mom wrote that, didn't she? She has to change Jamie's diaper whenever she messes it. Mom straps her to a medical table and makes her sleep in a coffin. Mom means business. His diapers changed. Jamie got a new potty, but she was a little afraid to use it. I remember feeling that way too. I told you. You know, maybe it's best that Salvador Dali didn't further explore Microsoft Paint during his final years. We use the potty every day. It helps us stay nice and clean. We love to wear our underwear. They feel soft if you know what I mean. Yep, before Miss Cleo's psychic career took off, she sang on cheap potty training videos. Feel like we have really grown, and now we're one of the crowd. Learn to use a potty, it's so easy to do. Use a potty and be like us. Yes, yes, join us. Worship our porcelain god. <laughs> If you want to 
feel proud and all grown up, then the body's a thing for you. Take the diapers and throw them aside. It's time to do like we do. <laughs> do, do. <laughs> play, just keep the party in mind. Sing our little happy song and use the party all of the time. So that's where my goldfish went. They like us, come on, we're counting on you. We hope that you will join us. Take a chance and you'll see. Though it looks too hard at first. Aren't you going to get that roof fixed, Daddy? Come on, everybody! Let's party! Come, my children, to the Cirque du Soil. What you listening to? The point, you wouldn't get it. <laughs> Do that potty thing. You say this when not running any bathroom footage. You're a master troll, kids. It's a party every day. That way we're nice and clean. Go on and wear your underwear. Pretty soon you'll join our machine. The bulge is missing from our clothes, and our moms and dads are so proud. We feel like we have really grown, and now we're one of the crowd. You know, maybe you should have brought a magazine, kid. Use a party and be like us. Come on, we're counting on number 43. Hope that you will join us. Yup, it's a toilet, all right. Though it looks too hard at first, it's easy as one, two, three. I want you to look. Oh, God. It's the Hey Jude of kitty songs. Be like us. Come on, we're counting on you. It's a fine line between Jamaican and Zsa Zsa Gabor. Two, three. Lovely, a voyeuristic double feature. This entertaining live action music video featuring such classics as Can't Get Enough of Flu, Baby. Doctor. Young children watch as boys and girls experience various aspects of a visit. Mom only picked this doctor because her last name was Ferling Getty. Oh, dang it. It's daylight savings time right now. Guess I can't order that copy of Strained Peas Are Yummy till fall. Darn. Well, I thought I Like My High Chair was a bit flaccid. I suppose I had to write him a letter about that. Oh, all right. I was already going to write you a letter anyway. So I was thinking of sending my kid to boarding school. What do you think, kids? Ids? I'd be willing to bet heavily that a slow day's worth of the donation box at the McDonald's drive through is considerably more than the Ronald McDonald house ever saw from this turkey. Today's other video takes a, uh, thankfully, slightly more academic route than that last one. This one comes to us from the Duke University Medical Center, and this tape was written and scrutinized and, most importantly, finally approved by some of the top pediatricians in the country, if not the whole world. And in 1991, this was considered the state of the art in toilet training your child. It's potty time. And right out of the gate, we're thrown into kitty video purgatory. It's Bobby's birthday, and you're invited to his party. And I'm sure it's going to be a real barn burner. Now he is four. He is growing up now more and more. Don't let that cute, innocent exterior fool you. Bobby's already got three misdemeanors, two felonies, and two illegitimate children under his belt. This is Bobby's birthday. I'd like me a woman who can open a soda can with her teeth. We make from a box of candles we counted out four. They came from a box marked Acme Hardware Store. Now Bobby knows animals by their names. And 
random petrified pterodactyl leg in the backyard. Check. He can ride a trike. Uh-oh, Bobby's out to make it four misdemeanors. And he's old enough to stay up all day long. Then you get a little older and realize that naps were awesome all along. And he just keeps learning more and more. This is gonna be your best birthday party ever, Bobby. Even better than the basement of the VFW hall back in 88. <laughs> Now that was wild. Sit on the potty. Okay, while well, you and Katie go to the potty, Bobby and I will clear the table. From a box of candles we counted out. And why are we still following Bobby when he's not going to the toity? Now this is Bobby's birthday and he is four. He's about as good at setting the table as I am. Period. Here's Lizzie. What are you doing here? It's party two. Lizzie, before we leave for Bobby's party, you need to go to the potty. Okay, Daddy. You need any help? No thanks. I can do it myself. That's my girl. That's right. Aim high. Or uh, better yet, don't, since we're talking urine. Uh, go for the g Damn it. I hate these kitty videos. I always dig myself into a deeper hole. I, I, I'm doing it again. Do! Yeah. We really good at this, aren't we, Teddy? On top of your party, you're sitting to poo. I lost my poor meatball. Oops, wrong parody. Your diapers don't droop. Get out, you pervy little sprite freak thing. Patient. Just sit there and smile. Or brood. I'm done, Daddy. Okay, don't forget to wipe, flush, and wash your hands. Now we have to wipe ourselves, Teddy. I'll show you how. Wipe, wipe, wipe yourself, always front to back. Carefully, carefully, now you have the knack. Wipe, wipe, wipe yourself, always front to back. Wipe, carefully, wipe, wipe carefully, yourself, now always you front have to the back. back. Carefully, wipe, wipe, carefully, wipe yourself, now you have the knack. Wipe, wipe, wipe yourself, always front to back. Wipe yourself off. Oh, that poor bear must get such terrible constipation. Now you have the knack. Wipe, wipe, wipe yourself. Always front to back. Carefully. Get out! Anyone got any Sprite aside? Now we have to flush and wash our hands. Then we're going to be all ready for Bobby's birthday party. Which ended three hours ago. That teddy's probably a bacteria farm. Kind of like my ex. Hey, she is a super duper pooper. Oh, I'm gonna be hearing from the found footage festival's lawyers now, aren't I? No, no more. Come on, doggy. One bite would finish the demon sprite off. Just one bite. Very impressed. She is a super duper pooper. She knows when she has to go. Must be rough to peak that early. Now she's a big girl, now she's the best pooper we know. Yay! The party's about to begin. Oh, piss off. I, I did it again. Whoa, there's a green screen there. You mean Susie Sue has always had those eyebrows? You learn something new every day. Hey, nobody gets in for free, bub. And we've officially obliterated every birthday I've ever had combined. I'm not bitter. Bruce, 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 Bruce. Bruce, 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 Bruce. Wow, it's a literal dickhead. Didn't think they existed. I'm a clown. Yes, I get that, Senator, but was the outfit really necessary? <laughs> 
I tried to make you laugh and fail. Don't like to see you frown. I'm a clown. That's right, that's right. And a lousy lip syncer. A clown. <laughs> I want to make you- Let me guess, those hats are gonna go all silver shamrock on those kids, right? Or they'll just give them lice. Make magic! You have it up your sleeve. There, lice for everybody! Make magic! If you just believe I'm a clown. Oh, so are you. Yes, I realize that life is one giant farce, but I don't think a four-year-old's birthday party is a good place for deep philosophical discussion. <laughs> then he throws the slobbery koosh ball at the birthday boy. Dad, where are you going? You're coming right up here. I don't know. What's a big idea? You know, I just realized that the clown and the demon sprite are the same person. <laughs> Two more years and it's your turn, little sister. You know, the same thing happened to me back in 89 at the Ringling Brothers show in front of 20,000 people. We wonder why Benny Boy hates clowns. <laughs> We'll make magic. You have it up your sleeve. Look at here. We'll make magic. <laughs> if you just believe. Clown, touch me again and I'll turn your squeaky horn purple if you get my drift. So are you, and you, and you, and you. <laughs> Put on your party smile. You'll be a great clown too. <laughs> oh no, no. <laughs> Now Billy's clothes have the clown measles. I'm going to go out on a limb here and guess that the kitty laughter was dubbed in. So Billy is going to have an accident now? Wasn't this supposed to be a potty training video? Bobby's birthday, now he is four. He is growing up. More grown up than any four year old should ever have to be. He can comb his hair, he can throw a ball high into the air. This was Bobby's birthday, we had a cake. So that tiny cake was supposed to serve 15 kids and their parents? Cake from a box of candles, we counted out four. Each year, Bobby learns more numbers. Let's see, Bobby learned jealousy today. Now Bobby knows animals by the- Bobby learned how to feign surprise today. Oh yeah, and his PTSD is kicking in. Already. Ride a trike, he can sing a song, and he's old enough to stay up all day long. And now he's gonna be up all night long too. Day, and he is four, and he just keeps learning. Can watch you all use the toity now. <laughs> it's potty time has been brought to you by Liquid Plumber. Cause if that don't clean you out, nothing will. She can potty with the best. You know, something tells me the consultation with Dr. Howard went something to the effect of, yeah, whatever. As long as I get paid. He is a super duper pooper. I just can't do it. I mean, I, I, of all people, can't come up with a whole episode's worth of potty jokes. I mean, I was really throwing my best shit at this one. Oh, well, um, that's it for today's archive. Excuse me. <laughs> Stupid power of suggestion. Anyway.